Hi, this is Nicolette out here at Hidden Villa. I'm one of the teachers and uh, one of the activities that we like to do with the kids is take them on a big hike through our beautiful wilderness. So the wilderness is on a hill and we want to make sure the kids always stay on the trail. Otherwise, you can kind of tear up the sides of the hill and when it rains, all of that loose dirt is going to roll down the hill and that's called erosion. So what I want to do today is show you a little demonstration that explains why you want to stay on the trails when you go walking around in the wilderness. You don't want to step on the plants that are kind of holding the, the roots of those plants are holding the dirt onto the hill. So we have two boxes here. One is filled with some grass and so you can imagine underneath this dirt there are roots and those roots are holding on to the dirt here. And then on the other side we have a box that just has dirt. No plants, no roots, and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour some water on each of these boxes just as though it's raining and we'll see what the result is, okay? So let's start with the box that just has dirt. And I'm just going to rain a little bit here. Raining, it's pouring. So we're just going to put a little water as though it's a big thunderstorm, big rainstorm here at Hidden Villa. All right. And that's going to start to pour out the bottom into the box down below. All right, so we'll let that drain a little bit and we can pour the water in this one which has the grass and all the roots. And I'm really just going to let it pour, pour, pour here. And what we'll do is we'll look at the difference between the water that comes out at the end of the uh, dirt box and the water that comes out at the end of the grass box. All right, we've had a nice, lovely rainstorm going on. Okay, let's check out what happened. So, do you notice that in the box where we poured into the dirt, we have a bunch of dirt in this water. So what happened was, because there's no roots to grab onto that dirt, all the dirt uh, rolled down with the water. And so that means that um, the water, the, the, the dirt is going to be less and less and less on those hillsides, so less dirt for the plants. Now let's look at the one that we did where we had so we had uh, plants. Look at this, very little dirt came out the bottom because these roots are holding on to that dirt, right? The other thing that happens is because the water can't just go straight down through the dirt, it actually slows down and soaks into the ground. So that actually helps the plants grow. All right, so let me ask you this. Is erosion a bad thing? So, is erosion a bad thing? Well, it's not. It's a natural process that happens in the wilderness. And it's been shaping the, uh, the hillsides here for thousands, maybe even millions of years. So, it's, it's, that itself is not a bad thing. But when so many people come out and share the wilderness and hike around, we just want to make sure that they're not making that erosion go so quickly that it's actually damaging the wilderness. This is Nicolette at Hidden Villa. Hope to see you on the farm.